All right, so hey, what's up, guys? Um, I'm back with another video, and uh, this originally was gonna be posted on December 27th, but I had some problems recording, so I just got a pickup game and uh, a Black Ops game. But I got an Epic Jordan game coming soon, so trust me, you guys are gonna love that game. But anyways, um, this is just really a 2010 recap. Uh, it's been a long year, and I've come a long way. Um, I began commentating, of course, a year ago, December 27th to be exact. I checked my uh, videos. It's hard to believe, you know, I've really come a long way back then, you know, I didn't really know what I was doing, didn't know what to say, was constantly nervous, but, you know, after a few months, you eventually get used to it, and uh, it becomes more natural, so, that's pretty much how it is now. I'm sure a lot of you for Christmas maybe got uh, games, recording equipment, maybe want to start making videos. If there are any of you are, any of you out there who are making videos, you know, I'm always open to dual comms, if you, if you really want to do one, you know. So, I just want to talk about the whole commentary business and you know how it's like uh as i'm repeating again i've done it for a year now um there's nothing really uh at first it's kind of nerve-wracking because you know you don't really know what people are going to think about your voice you know how you sound uh you don't know what you need to talk about so you kind of just go off of what other things you've seen so it's kind of uh like i said it's kind of nerve-wracking you know trying to figure out exactly what you need to say but um after a while, you get used to it, and you don't really worry about that thing, those that stuff anymore. You know, you just go with the flow. You know, you it becomes like uh, something you do every day. Once you know, you start posting more and more videos. You know, you get so much more used to it. You know, it's like repetition. You know, riding a bicycle over and over again to learn how to you know ride it. I guess um, that's kind of how it is. You know, just continually doing it over and over. So, I'm sure, some of you out there, you know, got your recording equipment, and um. Like I said, always open. Send me a message and I'll uh, try to get back with you guys. So, um, one more thing before I continue this 2010 recap. Uh, I actually played a Jordan game, my first game. Epic game against the Boston uh, Celtics. You guys are going to love that one. Like, I'm not even playing. All the other stuff, bulletins I posted about loving games, you're going to love this one. This one's going to be epic. This wasn't the most epic game I've played so far on 2K11. But uh, anyways, yeah. So a year ago, December, you know, I started my commentating thing. I had, uh, I originally used the, um, a DVD recorder. I recorded off of that. Then I put it on my computer. Quality wasn't too great, but it wasn't too bad. So, you know, it was manageable. But back then I only had, uh, 70 subscribers. And now I'm up to, uh, 933 last time I checked, which is about 15 minutes ago. So, uh, you know, time really flies by. It's been a whole year. You know, of course, back then I was, uh, I actually started my comment. I mean, I actually started making videos when I was 14, back when I was a freshman. That was when I originally got the DVD recorder to make uh, montages, things like that. You know, I, I guess you could call me a fanboy or whatever. But, you know, that was what I liked. You know, that was something I enjoyed. But, um, you know, eventually I grew out of it. And, you know, I wanted to do the commentating thing more and more because, you know, I was getting a laptop and stuff. I had it for a year now. So that's when I began my commentating thing a year ago. I was 15. I'm 16 now. Um, so you don't really have to worry about the quality. People really, um, well, quality is a big thing, but also the commentary. You know, you want to keep it interesting or helpful. You know, something somebody's going to want to watch for, you know, extended amount of time. Not just, you know, click it and uh, leave. So, you know, um, you don't have to have the best quality. I use a DVD recorder. Eventually, I moved on to an easy cap so I can use direct capture. Then around March this year, I got a, a Dazzle. And, you know, that's pretty much when my channel took off, you know. Um, it wasn't, like, a huge jump, but the quality was a huge jump. Um, before, you know, I had pretty crap quality with that Easy Cap. It was terrible. Um, that worked out for maybe a month. So after that, I got the Dazzle. I spent 50 on it. Um, I already had the required S-Video cables for the good quality. You need S-Video cables for the good for the quality I get. Otherwise, you won't be able to get the, uh, the nice quality. You'll just have average or below average. This isn't exactly HD, but it's close enough to it. That I can uh, I can live with it, you know, without buying HD PVR. But you know, there are guys out there who want to spend 200 on that. Me personally, I'm not going to, because that extra 150, I can buy me some shoes, some clothes, you know. There's some other stuff I can do with that. So you know, I'm not going to spend 200 on a HD PVR. You don't have to. My quality's just fine. So guys out there, you don't have to spend the 200. Just buy what I have, the Dazzle, buy the S video cables, and uh, it's pretty easy to figure out once you look at some. Some videos, you know? So anyways, um, 
You know, I've gained nearly 900 subscribers now since that last year. Back in uh, two, uh, December 2009. We're moving into the, u the new year now. Um, uh, my New Year's resolution for, uh, I guess, for YouTube would be to try to get at least at least 3,000 before, you know, this time again next year, 2011. Because by then I'll be a senior in high school, you know, sending all my applications. You know, I'll be going, thinking about college. That'll be the only thing on my mind that time during the year, you know, because it'd only be a semester left. So I got a year and a half to college now. And, um, I don't know, things are working out great right now. I'm really enjoying this whole YouTube thing. Uh, I really like all the support you guys are giving me. It's really keeping me going because sometimes, you know, I just feel like I just don't feel like posting videos. But then, you know, I post a video and I see you guys' comments, you know. I know it sounds cliche or cheesy or something like that, but, you know, getting great comments, getting lots of likes, views, you know. It keeps me posting the videos because it lets me know that there's somebody, somebody out there who actually enjoys the videos. And, um, you know, that's pretty much the reason why I'm continually doing this stuff. So I hope I get another great year here. Um, I'm going to continue on with this same content. You know, nothing different. There's no reason to change it. This is working out for me. 2K11 and Black Ops, you know, they go hand in hand. Tons of people like both games. You know, maybe throwing a Let's Play of Gears, I mean, God of War 3. I've been thinking about that. It's been on my mind. You know, I haven't decided yet. But, you know, that's been on the, the uh, you know, the outside of my mind, you know, where I'm thinking. You know, it's just always there. So, um, you know, there's tons of new things. Um, you guys can suggest ideas in the uh, comments below. Maybe you guys want to play Black Ops with me. I don't know. I could do, like, subscriber sessions or something. You know, you guys can come play with me. You know, one time out of the week. Maybe two times out of the week. You know, when I'm open. So, um, just tell me what you guys think about that. About me playing with you guys. Because, you know, I can't just accept everybody's friend request as much as I would like to. So, um, tell me what you think about that uh, down below in the comments down low down below in the comments <laughs> already messing up here but um yeah i really don't know what else to say um if you have any questions about you know your dazzle if you bought one um youtube in general just send me a message if anybody has a question about machinima don't ask me the only thing you need to do is just read their directions on their channel to get on machinima sports if any of you guys do that stuff or want to do it or are interested in it so you don't have to ask me. You know, you can just check their channel, get the instructions and everything. But yeah, 2010 is ending now. Um, as I look at the clock right now, it is 6:51. Uh, I live in the east, so that's why I guess some of you might live in the west. You might be seeing this video later, like it might be earlier there for you. But you know, it'll be the new year soon in what five hours or nine minutes, I believe. If I'm wrong, then put. I don't know. If I'm wrong, then it's, I'm just wrong. I, I don't care. But anyways, yeah, the new year, um, I hope to do a lot more things, maybe more uh, collaboration videos. I got another friend who's going to start getting into videos. Um, maybe we'll do some dual commentaries or something like that. Um, his name is, you've seen him in a lot of my uh, my Black House videos. Oh my God, he's been in a lot of my Black House videos. So him, hopefully me and Hunter can get some stuff done. Hunter, if you're watching this, you know, just, just got to send me a message on Xbox or uh, YouTube, you know doesn't matter or any other guys out there you know it doesn't matter just send me a message personal message I prefer not a comment because I don't really pay, pay attention to comments but um that's pretty much it for this video guys I'll leave you with the rest of this gameplay which is like five seconds and uh I'll see you guys in the new year later